Hello and welcome from Budapest. This is Hungary Reports from Public Media M1, bringing you a brief news roundup in English. I'm Arpad Sertzi. Great that you can be with us. Monday sees school and healthcare employees in Hungary getting the antigen rapid test for coronavirus. The test is voluntary, but authorities are asking people to take advantage of the opportunity. Healthcare workers will be conducting the tests themselves, while medical teams will be going to schools and educational institutes to test employees there. Those who test positive will have to inform their family physicians and go into quarantine. The country's chief medical officer said that she hopes that mass checkups will slow down the spread of the pandemic. Free flu shots are still available for every Hungarian citizen, according to the country's National Health Care Center. Three quarters of supplies for adults have already been made available and 13 counties now have their full contingent. And in counties where there isn't enough, more will be on the way. Parents are being asked to notify their family physicians by the end of the month if they have children under the age of three whom they would like vaccinated. Hungary only allows vaccines to be used that are proven to be effective and safe. That's what the country's chief medical officer told public media's M1 news station. Dr. Cecilia Müller said that Hungarian experts will be thoroughly examining a Russian vaccine against coronavirus that arrived earlier in the week. If they find the vaccine safe, then those who want it can get it. It's not compulsory, and other vaccines could also soon be on the way, such as from other parts of Europe and China. Hence, people will have a number to choose from. The Hungarian government is working on the details of another economic recovery package. General measures are expected, which could help those sectors affected by the pandemic. Over the past six months, Hungarian employers and employees have received several rounds of financial aid, Thanks to those measures, experts say that almost one and a half million jobs have been secured. Hungarian Public Media's annual charity drive program, It's Good to Be Good, has already collected more than 45,000 euros in donations. And if you live in Hungary, you too can make an automatic contribution by simply dialing 13616. Every call automatically generates a donation of 500 forints, about 1 euro and 39 cents, that goes to help families affected by autism. Hungary's professional athletes are also pitching in, donating personal sporting memorabilia that will be auctioned off. The organization called Together for Autistic People Foundation will be using the funds for various projects. The final TV program, including the auctions, will be on December 20th. And that's all for now from Hungary Reports, but we'll be back live the next night at around 11.20 p.m. Central European time. You can also catch us in repeats and online. Thanks very much for watching, and please wear a face mask. Take care, and peace on